What is going on guys? I am here with a, another video and um, I'm going to be talking about a few things before I get into this story. I'm going to tell you guys I apologize also for not uploading the last few days. But in the background I have a 17 and 2 gameplay on Black Ops 3 on some uh, demolition. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Uh, just so you guys know, like I said, I apologize not for not uploading the last uh, few days. I've been having some issues going on with uh, family and I will talk about it later in another video when everything settles out and everything uh, gets figured out. Um, also, like I said, I'm going to try to get back into doing tutorials and stuff like that. I just haven't been in the mood for doing stuff like that and also I apologize not for uploading on my other channels. I do have four videos to edit for my funny moments channel and stuff like that. And then I'm going to try to get some videos for my second channel and my first channel like this. I'm going to try to get back into doing tutorials the best I can. So uh, I hope you guys can bear with me on that. And um, so yeah, uh, my the story I'm going to be talking to you guys about, as you can see in the title, is um, basically I went to go walk my dogs with my stepdad and we ended up losing them and having to look for them for about uh, maybe four to six hours. Now, where I live or was living at this time, I still like go up there and stuff to run my dirt bike and stuff. But we had some property which is about 170 acres or so, and we have these trails that I do ride my dirt bike on because I like to do kind of like enduro, which is like long distance. And we have trails to where we can go for miles, like going back and forth and around different things and over different stuff, and it goes into swamp land. And stuff like that um, it's really fun I really love it and uh, I'm very lucky but uh, anyways so we were walking and we were probably about I don't know 20,000 feet from the house and we were on one of the trails and our dog Sam at the time he's dead now and so is wolf uh, the only dog left alive in this story is Snowbell they didn't die because of this they they just got old and you know passed away uh, they both got loose, and because Sam is a hunting dog, I guess you'd say, uh, but he, whenever he sees something, or like a cat, or a, like a, um, squirrel or something, he goes after it like crazy. There's no stopping him, and he won't come back. So, he ran off and got loose from Jeff, and then Wolf and Snowbell followed him, of course. Uh, Wolf is an old German Shepherd, too, um, and, uh, so is Snowball. She's not as old right now at this moment. She's probably about maybe, I don't know, 12, maybe 10 or 11. Uh, Wolf and them at this time were probably about in around 11 to 12. But uh, at that time, Snowball was probably about 4 or 3. But um, this was a, around when I was maybe 9 or 10. And I'm 18 now, so as you can see, it was a while ago. But uh, yeah, um, we looked through the woods. We had to look for them, go into places that we hadn't trimmed out, you know, cut stuff back and everything because, uh, sorry about that. We, we had to go and look for them, obviously, and we were looking and looking and looking, and then we could hear them barking and stuff. So we basically went the entire opposite way of trying to follow them because they went off trail. Um, to cut things short, we looked for about four hours, um, and then we finally found them. Well, actually, we found Wolf first because she came back to us after a while, and then we found Snowbell because she came back, and then we found Sam probably another hour and a half later in some woods. He was just laying there on the ground. He wasn't hurt or anything like that. He was probably just tired from running so much. But um, basically, when we came out, we were probably only a thousand feet from the house because from our house, from where it's looking to the right of it, all around it is woods, except in the front, which is the way to get out, which once you go out of our property, it's a bunch of trailers, then it goes out to the road that leads up to the highway, which goes to Panama City Beach, basically. So it's really hard to find our property because it's surrounded by a bunch of other people, but we own all the property around there. But uh, yeah, basically we were really close to the house, but we didn't know it, and um, it was, and then uh, it was kind of, um, I don't know the right word, um, it was kind of like a um, face palm, I guess you could say, 
because we were right next to the house the whole time and we walked all the way back around and we didn't know it but um anyways so we found the dogs and i know i didn't explain it very well but it was a really long time ago and i wish i could have explained it better for you guys but um basically i lost my dogs and had to go find them and stuff like that uh so <laughs> Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this story. It wasn't really much of a story just telling you I lost my dogs. But, uh, yeah, um, I'll update you guys on this stuff, the issues I have once I figure out everything that's going on in the next couple of days. Uh, I'll probably find out next weekend or so. And in the meantime, I'm gonna try to get tutorials and stuff for you guys, um, and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to check out, check out my second and third channel and give the video a like if you enjoyed and subscribe for more if you're new um also i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the gameplay thank you guys for watching hope you guys have an amazing day peace and i'll see you guys next time the cdp stands strong <sighs> ain't no place they could hide from me one shot one kill won't even hear it coming <laughs>